I believe the state could uh, make adjustments. Um, currently, our staff uh, structure does not uh, reflect the entire body of Massachusetts and its race and, race and ethnic uh, backgrounds. And I think that we could make alterations to accommodate the needs of those various cultures. Uh, this is based upon visual um, standpoint. This is not based upon data. Uh, this is just what I see and what has been the practice um, of this state house. Uh, we have made some strides, but I do believe we can make greater strides. And I think that um, you will see a tremendous shift uh, in uh, not just the staff, uh, but the entire legislature across the board, uh, because uh, this uh, state has started to declare that it wants to see more people um, of color and varying backgrounds participating in state government at all levels. It's important for young people to be able to walk in the building and see someone that they identify themselves with um, in which their, uh, their upbringing was possibly or even just their cultural uh, as far as if they are Vietnamese and they see that there is a Vietnamese employee here, it gives them strength and hope to know that one day they can be in that position uh, and that what they are currently in is not the end and be all for what the, where they're going. Um, and so it gives uh, young black uh, uh, students the opportunity to see that uh, it's not just uh, good enough to stand and hold a sign as much as it's good enough to be uh, in the seat or it's good enough to be uh, the decision maker or it's good enough to be uh, participating and educating people um, on what the values are of a bill. We have to give our young people hope, and the only way we give them hope is by allowing them to identify uh, with others who are actually in those positions currently.